who decided to buy me this uh, Pokemon box today. So this is a Poltergeist V box, collection box, which is a Pokemon uh, collection box, which contains four booster packs, which I believe, I think they're all Rebel Clash. I think we've got four Rebel Clash, oh sorry, oh no, one Steam Siege. Oh nice, we've got an old Steam Siege. We've got a Sword and Shield, and we've got two Rebel Clash, and obviously the Poltergeist V promo card and the Poltergeist V promo playable card. You also get a code card for the deck and for the box itself. So as it says, one foil card, one oversized uh, card, four Pokemon booster packs, and a code card for this box as well. Sometimes a Pokemon is just a bit more refined and ghostly than you expect, such as Poltergeist V. Shaped like a teapot and filled with a strong brood indeed in this box you'll find the sophisticated black tea pokemon in two sizes together with treasure from a handful of pokemon tcg booster packs you would think that i would like this pokemon because it's like two of the things i love you know tea and pokemon but i thought this was quite a lazy design I'm not gonna lie just to let you know no code cards are going to be given away in this video they will be given away to discord members only so, if you are a Discord member, there are five TCGO code cards that I will be putting up in the Discord after this video is done. One Steam Siege. One Sword and Shield. Two Rebel Clash Packs. Oh, yep, yeah, and an oversized card to add to my collection because I've had this one before. What's good, my bro? How you doing? <clears throat> I was just saying, I'm gonna put these. Yep, I'm gonna put these uh, TCGO code cards up in the Discord, as they're only gonna be given away for Discord members from now on. So that's what we've got so far. Just gonna put the rubbish in the bin. Oh, naps. We went and got some Ritz. So don't worry, bro. We got Ritz. <laughs> we got Ritz. Also, bought some... Uh, these are called... How do you say that? Indomie Instant Noodles. Me, Gorgon, Hot and Spicy. Uh, Japanese Noodles, I believe. I bought these for, well, I absolutely bought these for 40p, so I'm going to try them maybe later or tomorrow. We've also got to unbox this bad boy as well, at some point in the future. And obviously we have four booster packs today to open up. The oldest one here is the Steam Siege one. Um, I need to go grab some sleeves because I've got a feeling that we might pull something. When Absa TV seems to get me Pokemon booster packs, I always seem to pull something or other. So, let's grab some sleeves for a minute. Do you have any left? I should have some. Let's see, let's see. So, before everybody goes nuts. <laughs> I've got this card now like six times. Because of the amount of boxes that I've opened up. I was saying earlier in this video, you would think that I would like Poltergeist. Since it's two of the things that I've loved. Which is uh, tea and Pokemon. But uh, I don't like the design of Poltergeist. Prefers evolution. Let's yeah, find some sleeves. Okay, so got some sleeves. Hopefully that'll be 
left. <clears throat> if you're enjoying the video, don't forget to uh, leave a like on the video. Shout out to Crystal, shout out to Jellio, shout out to Naps each and every single time. How you all doing? Everybody having a good night? Can I let the cat out of the bag now? Absolute the TV? About what you've got? What? What game did you download? Can I say? Because Shelly is here and Naps is here. Yeah, Naps so guys, it's 11 p.m. Uh, you mean 11 a.m. for you? <laughs> Who said that? Uh, Absa TV has downloaded none other than Fall Guys. So he has PlayStation Plus now. Um, so we all want to try and get into a match together later on. Uh, Jellio, can you do 10? As a Naps has already agreed to play. Also, Jellio, do you play the Pokemon TCGO? Because I'm going to put all the code cards exclusively up just in the Discord. So only Discord members. Yeah. 10 p.m. our time. Or Wales time, as Jellio likes to say. You can make it. Nice. Okay. Right. So without further ado, let's do this. Yeah. So as I said, all the code cards are going to be exclusively up in the Discord. I will not be giving away code cards in this video. So if you come to this video for code cards, you will not be getting code cards in this video. You have to be a Discord member in order to get the code cards that I give away. This is a Poltergeist box that we've opened up. So far, it's not technically a pull because it does come with the box itself. We've got the Poltergeist promo card. We've got the large oversized one. We've got a green and white code card for the box as well. So let's get this going. Long years of stability come to an end when shiny Mega Gardeva EX lays siege to the mighty Gear Palace with a host of greedy forces. The mythical Steam Siege Volcanion must wield the dual powers of fire and water to stop them. As the battles rage, Exernia break and Vivettel break face off in Pokemon TCG XY Steam Siege expansion. The Pokemon TCG XY Steam Siege expansion contains over 110 cards. Each player must have 60 cards in a deck in order to play. So, without further ado, let's get into this. Now, this is the oldest pack out of this box. Uh, then it's the Sword and Shield, and then it is the two Rebel Clash. Oh, green and white code card. So yes, Discord members will receive code cards. <clears throat> okay, Shellos is the first card for today with 70 health points. Being a water type with a dex entry of 422, it is a sea slug Pokemon with a dex entry uh, with a move of Rain Splash. What's good? I didn't even know you disappeared, man. You didn't say that you went. Uh, and then we've got Mankey, which is a Generation 1 Pokemon with 60 health points, and it is a Fighting-type Pokemon. It has two moves. One of its moves are Focus Energy, and the other is Flop. It is a Pig Monkey Pokemon with a Dex Entry of 56, and it is from Generation 1. Now we have Apon with 60 health points, being a Normal-type Pokemon with a Dex Entry of 190, having two moves, one of Tail Jab and the other of Fiddle Around. It is a long tail Pokemon. Drift Bloom, 60 health points, psychic type or mystic type. Dex entry of 425. It is a balloon Pokemon with the move of Transfer Pain. Then we have a C Dot with 50 health points, being a grass type with a dex entry of 273. It is an Acorn Pokemon and it has a move of Bide. Halucha, which is a wrestling Pokemon. It always reminds me of Lucha Libre. Um, Dex entry of 701, has an ability of Sudden Cyclone. When you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench, you may have your opponent switch his or her active Pokemon with one of her bench Pokemon. And it has a move of Acrobatics. 80 health points being a normal type. Ooh, nice. We've got Hydreon, 150 health points. Has a move of Crawl Fang and another move of Dark Burn. 
dex entry of 635. It is a brutal Pokemon, being a dragon type. So they were the two pulls. A Palm up next. A P Palm, sorry. 90 health points, which is a long tail Pokemon with a dex entry of 424 with two moves, one of Fury Chance and the other of Double Kick, being a normal type. Halucha again. Hold on. Did we pull Halucha twice? That's mad. No, because I had this as a box. I'm going to open the whole box. Um, 701. It's a wrestling type Pokemon with 80 health points. We pulled this twice, and we've got the normal version and <clears throat> and the shiny variant. And Anorific is the last card for today, with uh, 80 health points being a fighting type, having an ability of Restored Barrier. Each of your restored Pokemon has no weakness. X Scissor is one of its uh, moves. But yeah, um, I didn't even expect to get this today, as Absent TV just decided to get me this. So um, I'm just going to open it all today. But the great thing is, as I said, the code cards are only going to be given away to uh, Discord members. So <clears throat> it's just a nice video to watch. The, well, the PS4 isn't mine and the TV isn't mine. It's Absent TVs, but yes, she has them. You should have seen, uh, go and check out her videos. Obviously, I featured in the video. Um, she unboxed the TV. She unboxed the PlayStation 4. We plugged up the Seagate hard drive. Um, <clears throat> we did all that earlier on. Okay. I just woke up. Oh, sorry, bro. I forgot. Forgot about the time. Yeah, go check out the videos. Yeah, big shout out to Absolute TV, man. She's been doing a lot today. She's just chilling out now. So, anyways... Start a new journey and meet Pokemon V. Welcome to the Gala region. Meet more than a dozen powerful new V Pokemon, including the legendary Zantian and Zamazenta, and some like Stonejourner and Snorlax, that can evolve into enormous Pokemon V Max for even more power. You'll also find first partners Grokey, Scorbunny, and Sobble, little cuties like Wulu and Yampa, and a handful of familiar Pokemon in their new Galarian forms. Catch up with a new generation of Pokemon in the TCG Sword and Shield expansion. Go to www.pokemon.com if you want to find out about their latest and greatest products. <clears throat> As I said, all code cards will be given away exclusively to Discord members. Another green and white code card. I think Abster TV has is, is done me a good one here. So how many of these boxes were on the shelf? There was like eight or nine of the same box, wasn't there? And then there was only decks. And you just picked up a random one, didn't you? Abby. And I think she's fallen asleep. <laughs> oh. So, Kafan, 100 health points, normal type, has a dex entry of 876. It's a copper derm Pokemon with a move of Stomp. Baltoy, which is a fighting type Pokemon with a dex entry of 343. It's a clay doll Pokemon. Two moves, one of Beam and the other of Sand Spray, with 70 health points being a fighting type. Salandit. 50 health points, fire type Pokemon. There's a toxic lizard Pokemon with a dex entry of 755, having a move of smog. Galarian Ponita, 70 health points. It's a mystic type Pokemon, has a move of Cybolt, dex entry of 77, and it is a unique horn Pokemon. Minchinu, 60 health points, has a move of Tail Wap, dex entry of 572, and it is a Chinchilla Pokemon. Ferroseed, 70 health points. Which is a steel type Pokemon. What's good, Stanley? If you enjoyed the video, man, leave a like on the video, buddy, as it helps me out tremendously. It'd be nice to get like 10 likes on this video. Has a move of rollout. Dex entry of 597. Thorn Seed Pokemon. Boom! Nice. Mm -hmm. So I've pulled the hollow of this before. GM Genie. I got two suits in Spider-Man yesterday, by the way. Oh, nice. So how many have you got now? Have you got six? Because I'm sure you told me before, and you got four. 190. Just got two more trophies in Adam's Venture. Got six now. Well done. Um, it's a Copper Dern Pokemon with dex entry of 879. Has a move of Dig Drain and also a move of Muscular Nose. I know, it's quite beasty, right? I got... um. One or two okay pulls already. The Hydreon was probably my best pull so far. I have 61% of the suits. Nice. Alright, so before we continue on, I'm going to have to sleeve them. And I'm going to have to go get some more sleeves. 
funny enough, because I've now ran out of sleeves again. All right, let's finish this pack off and then I'll go get some sleeves. Electric type energy, followed up by energy retrieval. Pick up the two basic energy cards from your discard pile into your hand. Heat more with 110 health points, being a fire type Pokemon. Uh, Dex entry of 631. It's an armadillo Pokemon with two moves, one of fire claw, the other of searing flame. And then we have Drizzlis, Drizzlile. With 90 health points, being a water type Pokemon, having a move of Water Drip with a dex entry of 817, being a Water Lizard Pokemon, having an ability of Shady Dealings. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may play your deck for a trainer card. You may search your deck for a trainer card and reveal it. Put it onto your hand and then shuffle your deck. Alright, let me go grab some sleeves. Some more sleeves, and we are ready to go again. Now I'm hoping that I can pull maybe a GX. Well, sorry, it can't get GXs anymore because they're not in it. They don't do GXs anymore. Yeah, uh, what is Greedfall about anyway, uh, Jadio? Because I've seen it on the store. I haven't downloaded it because I don't. I don't know what the game is about. And I don't know if Stanley has um, Fall Guys or not. It's like British people. What do you mean, it's like British people? Right, Rebel Clash. Obviously, I'm not going to read the back twice because of this. they're the same. We're going to play Guess the Energy, right? So, obviously, in the last pack, it was electric. So, I think in this pack, it's going to be a water-type energy. Everybody let me know in the comment section down below what energy do you think is going to be inside of this pack. I've said water. You let me know what you think is going to be inside of this pack. Rock out with the new Pokemon. Crank it up loud and blast at the beat. You'll find Rebellion, Chaos, and Punk Attitude Galore in the Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Rebel Clash expansion. Loaded with Pokemon V, including Toxtricity EV, Double V, Bolton V, Sandicona V, and more. You'll also find a handful of Pokemon V Max, including the final evolutions of the three first partners. Plus Copper Jar VMAX and Dragapult VMAX. Take to the stage and the streets with the Sword and Shield Rebel Clash expansion. So what did we all say? So Jellio said fire. Oh, you said Greedfall is like... Greedfall is one of the games that's free this month on the PlayStation Store. And Jellio's described it as it's like British people. What do you mean? They have swords. We don't all have swords. Alright, so you said fire and I said water. Nose pass, 80 health points. It's a compass Pokemon, dex entry of 299. Rock type Pokemon, um, fighting type Pokemon with two moves one of rolling tackle, the other of tackle. Wingle, 70 health points. It is a seagull Pokemon with a dex entry of 279 with two moves one of water splash and the other of collect. Then we have Phantom, 60 health points, which is a grass type Pokemon with a dex entry of 708. It is a stomp Pokemon with two moves, one of Seed Bomb and the other of Dark Guidance. And looking for the Lord. And they fight. We have guns. They look for the Lord's missing brother. Alright, Bronzor, 60 health points, which is a Steel-type Pokemon. It is obviously a Bronze Pokemon with a Dex Gentry of 436, two moves, one of Ram, and the other of Speed Dive. Then we have Toxor, with 70 health points, being an Electric-type Pokemon, 
with a dex entry of 848. It's a baby Pokemon with a move of tight jaw. But where is the card that we pulled today from this pack? 140 health points, dex entry of 760. It's a strong arm Pokemon having two moves, one of big throw and the other of hammer arm. Trevenant, 130 health points being a grass type Pokemon. It is an elder tree Pokemon with a dex entry of 709. It has two moves, one of Shadow Cage and the other of Seed Bomb. And then we had a fire type energy. Let's go, Jellio. You got it right. Then Dewblade with 70 health points being a steel type. 680. It's a sword Pokemon. Two moves, one of Slash, the other of Double Slash. And then Lombre having an ability of top entry once during your turn if you drew this Pokemon from your deck at the beginning of your turn and your bench isn't full before you put it into your hand you may put it onto your bench and it also has a move of fury swipes dex entry of 271 it is a jolly Pokemon with 90 health points being a grass type and the last card from this pack was a hatch room with 80 health points being a psychic type having two moves one of brutal swing the other of calm mind having a dex entry of 857 being a um Servine Pokemon. Alright, one pack left. Not, not them too bad to be fair. I had two green and white codes. So. This is what we've got. A copper jar. Hydreon from Steam Siege. Beware. Ferris Seed and a Halucha. Hold on. Oi Green Blood. Wish for the best for this pack. What is a yeah, what's Green Blood? Cause I ain't at like I'm from the UK and I never heard anybody and or anything in history where anybody was like, and here's a green blood. Sounds like you've been watching Harry Potter. Ooh. Green and white code card. Let's go. Wingo, 70 health points, seagull type Pokemon, dex entry of 278, two moves, one of waste, splash, the other of collect. Coffin with 70 health points, which is a darkness type Pokemon, dex entry of 809, being in a poisonous gas. I really don't understand why I did that. Hold on. Right. Suffocating gas. Right. Next. Bronzo, 60 health points. Bronze type Pokemon, dex entry of 436. Two moves, one of Ram, the other of Speed Dive, being a Steel type. Toxel, 70 health points. Electric type Pokemon having a move of Tight Jaw. Dex entry of 848, and it's a baby Pokemon. Litwick up next with 60 health points, being a Fire type Pokemon. Dex entry of 607, being a Candle Pokemon having a move of Scorch. Then we have Palippa. 120 health points being a water type Pokemon with a dex entry of 279, which is a water bird Pokemon with two moves, one of wing attack, the other a power cyclone. Ooh, nice, 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 nice. Duraludon, 130 health points, which is a alloy Pokemon, dex entry of 884. Two moves, one of metal sharpener and the other of power beam. Water type energy. Skyler, which is a trainer supporter, search your deck for a trainer, reveal it, and put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Luxio, 90 health points. Electric type has a move of zap kick and an ability of top entry once during your turn. If you drew this Pokemon from your deck at the beginning of your turn and your bench isn't full, before you put it into your hand, you may play, you may put it onto your bench. Uh... Dex entry of 404, and it's a Spark Pokemon. And last but not least, we have a Dracloak. 90 health points being a Mystic type. Dex entry of 886, and it is a Caretaker Pokemon with two moves, one of Bite, and the other of Summon. So we ain't done too bad today, to be fair. 
We're going to recap quickly anyway. Jack Locke, Luxio, Litwick, Toxel, Bronzo, Coffin, Wingo, Hatterm, Lombre, Dublant, Trevolant, Toxel, Bronzo, Phantom, Wingo, Nosepass, Drizzlile, Heatmore, Mincino, Galerian Ponita, Salandit, Balto, Kafantz, Anorif, Halucha, Ampi Pom, Cedar, Drefloon, Apom, Mankey, and Ashelos. Energies were fire, water, and electric. Trainers and item cards for today were energy retrieval and the Skylar. And pulls. Let's just put these into some sleeves. So polls for today. Let's sort these out. So copper jar, hydrion, Duraludon, beware, Philippa, Alucha, and a Pharaseed. Not to mention, obviously, the Poltergeist V promo and the oversized large promo as well. We open a total of four booster packs. We have five TCGO code cards. If you are part of the Discord and you have joined the Discord, I'm going to be putting up code cards over on the Discord. So join the Discord and uh, help us grow. And uh, yeah, you can enjoy the code cards over there. But otherwise, thank you once again for watching another episode of GMG News. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you haven't done already. I will be back in approximately like two or three minutes because I'm going to next be opening up none other than this, which is the Incredibles Lego Disney Pixar PlayStation 4 game, which is none other than Abs the TVs. As I said, we have a total of five TCGO code cards that I'll be giving away, but I'm only going to be giving these away in the Discord. So, got to join the Discord, as I said. Four of them are green and white, and one is green. So yeah, we'll put them over there. But next up, I will be opening up the Incredibles Disney Pixar Lego PS4 game. So, I'll be back in a minute. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Big shout out to all the subscribers. Big shout out to Naps. Shout out to Jerio. Uh, shout out to Stanley. Shout out to Lando. Shout out to Sharpnell. Shout out to Smiling Ratcake. And big up everyone who puts in a tremendous effort to watch my uh, channel. I appreciate it highly. Have a great day and keep on smiling.